Why hello there, and welcome to Revolting Reviews. I am Random Ross, and today I am reviewing the film P2. So this is a horror thriller film uh, directed by um, by Frank um, Carl uh, Helfrum or something. I'm butchering the guy's name. I'm not going to try and get it right. Starring Wes Bentley and Rachel Nicholas. So this is, a, as I've said already, a horror thriller where. A young woman named Angela uh, is coming home for a Christmas Eve party and then gets locked in the parking bay of of where she works in her office block and soon finds herself with you know, on level P2 parking 2 where she comes across the security guard um, Thomas played by Wes Bentley and starting off as a bit of a creep, you know, wanting to like, you know, woo her, give her a Christmas meal, and, you know, and she finds that there's something clearly off with this guy, at first appearing nice to her, but then all of a sudden becoming a crazed, deranged psycho, and wanting to, and like forcing her to like him, and yeah, it goes from that, from like, a kind guy, to a deranged lunatic that wants her and the whole film takes place on Christmas Eve they even have a Christmas song in the soundtrack Elvis Presley Blue Christmas in the film uh, playing in the film so yeah this like I said this is a horror thriller and it takes place on Christmas Eve so yeah I'm gonna yeah I'm counting this as a Christmas horror film uh, and yeah I've only just heard I heard of this film this year it came out in 2007 and yeah I saw it about a month ago not realizing it was a Christmas film but I still watched it and um, yeah I think this is a very underrated film because I don't hear enough people talking about it and it clearly went over the radar okay let's get to my likes and dislikes so first of all the likes I like the performances in this uh, with our two lead actors there's only two people that star in it. Yeah, they have a few characters here and there. They have like some extras that are like office workers getting off because it's Christmas Eve and we have like some cops that come in uh, in the film and we get some um, like a homeless woman. Um, yeah, so yeah, I, but yeah, I like the performances from our two main act actors. Um, I thought that um, Rachel Nicholas was great in this. And um, who else? Oh yeah, Wes Bentley was great in this. Um, and yeah, the horror really does escalate when when he starts to like get make want like trying to force her to kill her boss uh, that he holds hostage. And he also you know just does all these crazed maniac things, and he even uses his dog, his Rottweiler, as a weapon. Um, now, I should warn you, first of all, yes, a dog does die in this film. For you dog lovers, I'm giving you the heads up, you know, because I know some of you, you are like, all right, when a human dies, but when, like, a dog dies, you're like, no! Which I kind of felt sorry for, you know, because the dog did die, but our protagonist, Angela, killed the dog in self-defense because, like I say, he, was, he taught the dog to attack her. Which, you know, and I thought, oh, the dog's dead. So, for you, animal, for you dog lovers out there, yes, a dog does die in this, I will tell you that. Because I know, like I said, there are some people in there in horror that, you know, think, oh, no, not a dog. You know, especially Nightmare Maven. You know, if you're watching this, I'm, I'm just giving you the warning that an animal does die in this. Because I know how you feel about the death of a dog in a horror film so and not just her but many others so there uh, but yeah the film in this was great there was suspense in this the suspense was good and the violence was quite brutal in this too 
Um, there were moments in there where it's like she managed to contact the police, but then it's like, you know, the police all of a sudden come and it's like, you know, the, the police are there, but she's like unable to reach, unable to get to them when they get here. And he and, and Thomas assures the police that it's a false alarm, everything's fine, and the police buy it, and then, yeah, I'm like, no! But, you know, it, what happens, it, that's what can happen in a horror film with police and stuff. Um, but yeah, I, I do like, I like this film. Now for my dislikes. I didn't like how there were a few dumb decisions made in this film, but, you know, but there were smart decisions too. Um, this film was a bit of a slow burn at the beginning, but like probably I'd say half an hour, 20 minutes into this film, the, you know, it really does start to pick up then. Um, and yeah, and you're like rooting for this woman to try and get away from this creep who's insane. Wes Bentley does a great performance as his characters, as I said already, along with uh, Rachel Nicholas as Angela. This is, you know, an intense film. It's dark, it's gritty and yeah, like I say, underrated and I don't hear enough people talk about it. So, um, yeah, um, P2. So what am I going to rate this film? Do you know what? I'm giving P2, which is a Christmas horror film, a uh, Christmas horror thriller film, uh, I'm going to give it a... I'll give this a three and a half out of five. You know, three and a half Krampus switches out of five. So that has been my revolting review on P2. So, have you seen this one? Let me know down in the comments below. If you like this video, be sure to give it a big thumbs up. Please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and to hit that notification bell. Um, no pressure, but if you're new here and you like what you see so far, then yeah, feel free to sub and hit the bell. Uh, all my social media links are down below in the description. So, I've been Random Ross. This has been a revolting review. And on P2. So, until next time, do enough nightmares. Thank you.